Authority, I will call the Licensing Hearings and Public Safety Committee to order at 4.34 p.m. on March 13th, 2024. Uh, roll call. Alder Beldy is excused. Alder Heideman? Here. Alder Decker? Here. Alder Rust is present. Uh, I think we all know each other, so we don't need to do that. Uh, Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Alrighty. Looking for a motion to approve the minutes from February 28th, 2020. So moved. Sorry. Any discussion on those minutes? All those in favor of approving? Aye. All those opposed? Fair votes aye. Yes, I am number six, general ordinance number 42-23-24, 3-4-24, an ordinance reestablishing the formerly repealed sidewalk cafe regulations and making various changes and updates to said regulations as recommended by the city clerk and staff from the Department of Public Works. So basically, uh, we're reinstating the sidewalk cafe regulations. I think it was probably a little um, overkill to uh, to drop them. Uh, so they're, they're back. Uh, but what we're dealing with is um, the fees are decreased from what there had been. Uh, there's a distinction between the initial application fee and the renewal fee um, because less administrative work needs to be done um, when there's a renewal. Uh, but other than that, it's it's basically you know similar regulations as as what there was before. Uh, there had been an attempt to kind of shoehorn them into the encroachments ordinance, and that they're different than encroachments. So, Any questions? So why did we, why did they drop it in the first place? Because I remember Corey Bulk back, and they were one of the first groups that met and did this. Did, is this the same ordinance that they drew up when? Uh, it's yeah it's basically the ordinance i wrote years ago but it's been modified a few times over the years um, but the main change the reason it was dropped in the fall i think it didn't you know wasn't my idea but i think the thought was maybe it would be simpler if you include it with everything else but it just it doesn't work so motion to approve second all those in favor Aye. aye. All those opposed? Chair votes aye. That passes. Item number seven, resolution number 117-23-24. Resolution authorizing the purchasing agent to issue a purchase order for a 2024 Ford F-150 four-wheel drive pickup truck for the Sheboygan Police Department. Move to approve. Second. <laughs> All righty. I suspect they're not here because of the incident on the south side. Right. I yeah. Know, I, just, I know Lieutenant Walsh did indicate he was hoping to be here. Yeah, I don't see yeah. that's not an issue. All right. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. All those opposed? Chair votes aye. That's approved. I am number eight, RO number 122-23-24 by city clerk submitting a license application for Mojo and Breweries LLC. We're recommending granting the application. Hopefully they'll be Open quite a bit. Why? Um, yeah, no problem. Uh, why, why was this one separate? Why is this one coming through now? Or, you know, it's a new. It's a new owner. Um, oh, it's a new owner. Yeah. So, so basically, he did sell. The, yeah, he did sell. Okay. Um, and, so hopefully, well, I would think that imagine if they wanted to spend the money on buying, they would be their intention would be to be open. So I think so. Yeah. <laughs> Any other questions? Did anybody ever show the new owner the history of what the other guy went through? <laughs> so, that, so that there's an example there that says, you know, this is what you really don't want to do because the, the law and license committee really doesn't care for that. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't, I, did you guys even meet him when he came in or did he apply online? No, he, he came in a couple of times and let me talk. To He's him. a local He's owner? Is a local guy? I, you know, I, I would he have is. to check. I'm not sure. So I, I, I looked at the application. It's a guy. I think it's actually probably one of the former owner's former neighbors, because uh, the former owner lived in the 300 block of Huron, and this guy lives in the 400 block of Huron. 
who used to work for um, one of the insulation companies, Alpine. And oh, then sure. yeah. he went from there, and it looks like he went from there to owning his own insulation company. Um, uh, I forget the name of it, but that's who he's worked for before. Um, doesn't indicate that he's got any previous experience in this field, but obviously he saved up money to buy the bar. So. Okay. So it's a wise investment. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. Motion to approve. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. All those opposed? Chair votes aye. As approved. Next meeting date will be March 27th, 2024. To adjourn. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Chair votes aye. We are adjourned at 440.